Hey guys, today I'm going to be talking to you about Holden and his loss of innocence throughout the book, The Catcher in the Rye. Throughout the book, we follow Holden as he grudgingly makes the transition from adolescence to adulthood. After reading the novel, it is not unusual for people to dismiss Holden as merely a whining, spoiled brat. But after taking a closer look at his character, it's obvious that Holden is nothing more than a scared child, who is frightened by the overwhelming concept of maturity. The novel is a chronicle of Holden's life as he slowly loses what little amount of innocence he has left. When he leaves Pence, he is introduced to the corruption of the outside world initially through Maurice and Sonny. And later on, if that's not enough, his old English teacher, who was one of the few people he admired and looked up to, turned out to be untrustworthy as well. So all these factors combined together are only confirming Holden's ideas that everyone else around him is bad or phony. Which is another thing Holden uses to disassociate himself with others. Calling people phonies is his way of proving to himself that it's the other person who has the problem and not him. And even though it seems like these things would turn him against the outside world, he's still constantly seeking human interaction. He spontaneously calls old friends to hang out with him, but after he spends a bit of time with them, he realizes that they all have grown up around him. When he asks Sally to run away with him, she shoots him down, making it seem like the idea is childish, which it is. He couldn't even have a conversation with Luz, his old classmate, because every time Holden spoke, he came off as immature. So after seeing his friends change, Holden is slowly realizing that he isn't going to be a kid forever, which is a key revelation towards his loss of innocence. You are not alone, Holden.